near Margaret Holcomb's backyard. Here's the stump. There's an empty space next to the raspberries where her marijuana plant once was. Holcomb, who goes by Peg, says she's outraged after authorities removed the plant from her yard last month. I am a responsible and mature citizen. This was a violation, violation of my rights. Peg says she's been using marijuana for medicinal purposes and believes it has helped with her glaucoma. This is not right. This is not moral. This is bad, bad practice. The 81-year-old grandmother wasn't there when it happened, but her son Tim Holcomb was at his mother's property here in Amherst when he heard the helicopter overhead. It was long before he says state troopers were standing outside. And I asked them if they had a warrant, and they said uh, they could get a warrant if I chose to escalate. They just wanted the contraband. There would be no charges pressed. Troopers say it was a part of a marijuana eradication operation working with the state's National Guard. A spokesperson for the Massachusetts State Police says they support people's rights to use medical marijuana legally to improve their quality of life, adding that the law that prohibits unsecured outdoor grows makes no distinction about the reasons or circumstances behind it, going on to say, quote, once we have seen them, we have to seize them. The discretion we have is in whether to seek criminal charges and in most cases, we do not do so. Troopers say there were 44 marijuana plants seized in the operation on September 21st that were outside in plain view, including Holcomb's, adding that none of the property owners were charged. In Amherst, I'm to be CVB News Center 5.